Welcome back to Planet Base, played by Sleepless Ronin. We're going to resume our ice colony base and uh, see how things are going because last time we left it, we were doing a much better job balancing our balancing power, food, water. Let's see if we can't keep balancing stuff and get this a really big colony. That's the goal. The goal is to continue making a really big colony. Again, one of our biggest issues we always seem to have is metals, which I'm okay with that once we get this new biodome up and running. I'm going to begin mining again once I ensure that, you know, see, power storage is low. We got to, uh... okay, the wind is picking back up, checking our grid. It's definitely a bit underpowered, but nothing actually stopped working. Problem is, right now I'm generating very little power. Period. Right now, no wind. That's not good. It's my solar generator. Just not very powerful, and I just don't like this. I'm on an ice planet. Solar shouldn't be all that great, although, honestly, you'd think the, reflect you'd think the reflected light would actually be pretty good. But, of course... This means I need, I desperately need more metal. Because solar takes a lot more metal. This could be a rough evening. Come on, wind, pick up some. If you just pick up, I'd be okay. It's a problem being so reliant upon, like, nature. I mean, if I could build a nuclear reactor... Hey, power problems solved. Come on, pick up some wind. This is a really big problem. There's no wind blowing. It's a big, big issue. You know, the honest truth is these things can work in reality in like five mile or lower winds. They're, they're, they're able to produce... God damn it. Someone just cacked it. There's a nice blizzard. That should help jam my uh, power cells way up. Although I'm getting less power now than I was in when I had high winds. Now, how is that possible? Oh, my solar's off. The solar's probably not producing much of all during a, during a blizzard. That's not really an efficient increase, is it? It's one metal to build one of these at 5,000. And at 7,500, I get for two metal. For three metal, two metal. For 25, I guess roughly that is the same exact metal cost. My storages are almost out of space also. I think it's a good place for a dorm because it's really close to a bio lab and really close to a, a, a cantina and really close to the... Um, Multi-dome. I was going to say the exercise dome. I realized that was not right. One more metal. And then people can have another place to seep. And then I need to build another storage. Because storage is already... You know, storage is running out again. That was that period where I had like no wind. That sucked. Again, that's period with no wind. Don't know why you wouldn't just go for the maximum occupancy on one of those things. Oh, I built my bed and I laid right down on it. Dooty dooty dooty. Oh, you always run out of spares. I think I need to build a security center really soon, but. God, I need to build another storage. But I don't want to push my uh, limits. I'm trying to do a much more interconnected hive-ish colony. 
so that like it's a lot easier for the people to get from one place to another instead of walking in big old lines if I can have them where they're working a lot nearer to where they're living and and a whole bunch of other stuff where resources are coming in and out a lot easier okay what have you got for trade uh, what's your reach? Oh, goodbye. Won't trade with you at 60% commission. No way. No way, no how. Get me down to 45 or 40 and I'll trade. Go lower and I'll leave definitely trade. Where are you going now? That's a weird way to go. Instead of going over there, they ran over there. Oh, he's going back to work in the mine. Come on! Two more... Bioplastics. Man, there's a lot of supplies building up there. We need this storage built badly so we can transfer over to a proper place. I'm really glad, though, my food storage is out of, out of control. I mean, starvation should be a low factor. He's idle! Don't be idle! Go do something! Look at some beer. I have no idea what beer does. So, beer! Beer me! Yay, look at how fast they move stuff into there. Diddly 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 dee. Box of meat, box of veg, meat and veg, meat and veg. There we go. Okay, the newest battery is starting to finally charge. Once I get this new mine built I'm working towards, then I'm going to build a security station. Why is my water balance so wacky? Water balance really confuses me. Thirty-five percent commission, okay. Let's see if I can actually make this. I can't carry enough, okay. Now I can get some money too. That gives us some extra cash, lots of metal. That's a good trade. What the? Where are you go? What the? Where are you going? Well, you let it over there instead, eh? Give that some priority, bozos. I'm buying some spares. I'm buying spares and metals. I have some cash on hand now. It's amazing. Wow, I need more storage space. Again, wow.
What's your ratio? You probably suck. Yep, 60%. When they have a lot of variety, they seem to have some really cruddy exchange rates, so shove off. You're always running out of spares. Even though I literally just gave you more spares. Look at that spare metal for once. Holy crap. Power storage. When the wind dies off, it can be painful. Water storage, we're doing good. Power balance. Uh, sure. I don't know how to read this one. Like, is this good or is this good? I don't know. Water balance. Don't understand that one either. O2. Definitely probably need to build another O2, uh, another oxygen thing pretty soon. And we are four check stones of the moral stones. We need to... We really want to get here. That'd be awesome. Or ten techs or something like that. We want to try some of these... Try, we want to try to click all ten of them in this, balance, this, this colony. This colony is doing a lot better. And I'm building it a lot more carefully. Keeping these a lot closer to the vest. That's why the next thing we're going to build, we could probably build an oxygen thing. And another water thing. Because we're going to maintain... We want to make sure our supplies are constantly good. We don't want any of this crap to happen. Like the medical supplies. It's just... I need to build another lab, like, apparently. Or take one of my vitriol meat machines offline. People can do without the pork one. As soon as they're gone, I'm going to slap down another lab table. Wish I could prioritize moving these things. But I can't. That's where we stand at this moment. Colony's looking pretty balanced, which makes me pretty happy. And uh, we're gonna make sure we're gonna, we're gonna work really hard to maintain that balance and grow this colony as big as we can. We gotta do a lot better than we did on the Mars colony. This Titan or Europa or Hoth colony. So I hope everybody's enjoyed the this session so far. So please hit the like button and jam that subscribe button. And uh, we'll see you for the next one. Game on.